Alright, so you want to install Zorin OS 17 Pro. You've heard the buzz, you're intrigued by the possibilities, and you're ready to take the plunge into the world of Linux. And maybe you're a little nervous because Linux sounds scary, conjuring images of complex command lines and impenetrable configurations. Trust me, it's easier than you think, especially with Zorin OS, which is designed to be incredibly user-friendly. I'll walk you through every single step, holding your hand from start to finish. We'll break down the process into manageable chunks so you can follow along with confidence. Let's get started and transform your computer into a Zorin powerhouse. First things first. Before you touch anything, before you even think about partitioning drives or configuring bootloaders, back up your important files. Always smart. This is non-negotiable. Imagine losing all your photos, documents, and precious memories. A little preparation can save you a world of heartache. Now grab a USB drive, at least 4 GB. This will be your key to unlocking the Zorin experience. We'll turn this into your Zorin installer, a bootable device that will allow you to install the operating system on your computer. Head to the Zorin website, the link is in the description below for easy access, and buy or download Zorin OS 17 Pro. You have the option to purchase the Pro version, which supports the developers and unlocks extra features or download a free version to try it out. Once you've got the ISO file, which is essentially a digital image of the Zorin OS installation disk, you'll need a tool called Bellina Etcher or Rufus. These are free and easy-to-use programs that will help you write the ISO file to your USB drive. To burn that ISO to your USB, making it bootable. Open the tool, pick your Zorin file, the ISO you just downloaded, select your USB drive, making sure you've chosen the correct one, and hit flash. Double-check everything before you proceed, as this process will erase all data on the USB drive. Wait a few minutes, as the tool copies the Zorin OS files to your USB drive, and boom, your installer is ready. You've successfully created a bootable USB drive with Zorin OS 17 Pro. Now restart your computer. This is where the magic begins. With the USB plugged in, make sure the USB drive is securely connected to your computer. As your computer boots up, keep an eye on the screen. Press the key to enter the boot menu. This is crucial for telling your computer to boot from the USB drive instead of your hard drive. Usually F12, F10, or ESC. The specific key varies depending on your computer's manufacturer. If you're unsure, check your computer's startup screen. It usually displays a brief message indicating which key to press for the boot menu or BIOS settings. Or do a quick search for your model online. A simple search like your computer model boot menu key should give you the answer. Choose your USB drive from the list. The boot menu will present you with a list of available boot devices. Select the one that corresponds to your USB drive. Soon, you'll see the Zorin welcome screen. This is a sign that you've successfully booted from the USB drive and are on your way to installing Zorin OS. You can actually try Zorin without installing it, using the Try Zorin option, just to make sure everything works, that your hardware is compatible, and that you like the overall look and feel of the operating system. But I'm guessing you're all in, ready to commit to the Zorin experience. So click Install Zorin OS. Let's do this. Pick your language, keyboard layout, selecting the options that best suit your needs and then connect to Wi-Fi. This will allow Zorin OS to download any necessary updates and drivers during the installation process, if you want updates during install. It's generally recommended to install updates during the installation process to ensure you have the latest software and security patches. When you get to installation type, this is a critical step, so pay close attention. If you're switching fully to Zorin, dedicating your entire hard drive to the new operating system, pick Erase Disk and install Zorin OS. This will wipe your entire hard drive and install Zorin OS as the sole operating system. If you want to keep your old system, perhaps you want to dual boot Windows and Zorin, choose install alongside and follow the prompts. The installer will attempt to automatically resize your existing partitions to make room for Zorin OS. Want to get fancy? Choose something else for custom partitions, giving you complete control over how your hard drive is partitioned, but if you're a beginner, simple is best. Stick with the erase disk or install alongside options for a smoother experience. Set your time zone, create your user account, choosing a username and a strong password, and let Zorin handle the rest. The installer will now copy the necessary files and configure your system. The install could take 10 to 20 minutes, so grab a cup of coffee or tea and relax, depending on your computer's processing power and storage speed. When it's done, the moment you've been waiting for, you'll get a prompt to remove your USB and restart. This is important. 
do that, and you'll boot right into your new Zorin desktop. Congratulations, how cool is that? You've successfully installed Zorin OS 17 Pro. Now you've got a clean, modern Linux system, ready to be customized to your heart's content. That's super beginner-friendly, making it easy to navigate and use. Explore the App Store, discover new applications, personalize your look, changing themes, icons, and desktop layouts, and enjoy way more privacy and speed compared to other operating systems. And if you ever get stuck, don't worry, it happens to the best of us. The Zorin community forums are super helpful. You'll find a wealth of information and friendly users willing to assist you. That's it. You just installed Zorin OS 17 Pro like a pro. Give yourself a pat on the back. If this helped, hit like and subscribe for more easy tech guides. Your support helps me create more content like this. See you next time. Happy Zorin!